Hello and welcome back to Forza Horizon 4. Uh, earlier today uh, we tested out this thing, the new Top Gear EAT Mercedes diesel estate thing. Um, and we took the roof rack off, tried to turn it into a, a racing car and it didn't really work. Um, but anyway, uh, I'm back now to test out the tractor. Uh, and then tomorrow we're going to be testing out the, the G63 6x6 and the new Ranger Raptor. So let's find it. Top Gear. It's under Top Gear. It's the only car under Top Gear. Well, it's not really a car, but yeah, we're getting that. Um, have a go with it, see what we can do with it. Um, and, and see if it's actually good at anything because so far we've found that it, it, it's not very good at being a tractor. I mean, it's, it's not going to be very good at being a tractor anymore, look at it. Uh, and it's not very good at being a track car either, because it, it, it doesn't really like to turn, as I'll demonstrate here. Okay, it managed that. There, there, it, it's just, um, it's a bit sloppy to drive. Oh, um, and we've ended up in a field. I mean, there's a tractor, after all. Right, let's let's head to the garage up here at Bamborough Castle, as we're right next to it, uh, and, and see what we can do. This this is entirely stock at the moment. I mean, we can make it look more like a tractor by putting a, a John Deere livery on it or something. Oh, um... Yeah, that, that was me saying it doesn't turn. That, that's an example. We've, we've missed the, the bit where the house actually is. I think it's here. So many times I've gone into that um, team adventure thing by mistake instead of the castle. What a stupid thing it is. Right, let, let's have a look at this first. No aero. Uh, you can't really do anything with that. I mean, look how tiny those front wheels are compared to the. Okay. I'll put a racing V8 in it. Why not? Wait. It's rear wheel drive. Why does all wheel drive make it a, a lot worse? Right, that immediately puts it up to A class. This is going to be absolutely horrible to drive. Twin turbo with a, with a big V8, uh, and I've I've left it rear wheel drive. Hang on, what can you do with these? <laughs> what about the back? Uh, you can't make the, the wheels that big, really. What other bits can we throw on it? I mean, sure, let's just <laughs> throw a load of stuff on and hope for the best. I don't normally upgrade my cars too much on here, but as it's already a stupidly upgraded tractor, we might as well go with it and throw as much stuff on as we can. So I think I've done everything apart from an all-wheel drive conversion here. And let's hope it's, it's not quite as bad. Um, as the Mercedes estate that I managed to make absolutely rubbish at racing anything. That was to do with gears, really. They needed tuning. I mean, I'm quite good at making the cars look good, but I'm not very good at making the cars drive well. <laughs> right. Let's, let's first just have a look at this, uh, and then we'll go and find a design. Okay, that's the only option we've got. Do we keep the Top Gear logos? No. Interesting. On the Mercedes, when you painted it, you still kept the Top Gear logo. Um. But yeah, let's, let's find a proper track delivery for it. There we go. We've got a, a John Deere. We've also got um, some monster energy designs. We've got a few 
Yeah, we, we've got quite a few John Deers here. We've also got that. Which looks completely mad. Yeah, yeah, sure, why not? Why not put flames on our tractor? Our tra tra tractor. Right, then we've got to go and see if it can actually do anything. And the trouble is, it I think it puts it as a extreme off-road vehicle when it's been turned into a track vehicle. So I think we might have to go to our old friend Bamber Coast Circuit, um, just around the corner. And put it up against the anything goes uh, a lot of cars. I mean, yeah, the, the trouble we're going to have is um, turning. Anyway, let, let's try three laps of three laps of Bambra. Unbeatable difficulty AI. Anything goes. Or what could possibly go wrong? Uh, three laps. That's the one. This is what we tried the Mercedes out on. Um, if you watched the video earlier today. Yeah. It's, it's basically a hot rod. Well, it looks like a hot rod. Big wheels at the back, little wheels at the front, flames. Quite quick in a straight line, won't go round corners. It, it, is, it is just a hot rod. Basically. It is also very stupid, and I don't know why they made it. Right. This could be interesting. Really, we need to find a... a track with a lot of straights, because in a straight line it's actually not bad. Maybe I'll try the motorway drag race, although I don't think it'll turn enough to manage the corners on that. Oh dear, that, that's some horrible understeer, followed by some deadly oversteer. That's a wall. I mean, to be fair, this is a tractor, so it's never going to be that good. The, the Mercedes could have been good at something if I knew what I was doing. But this kind of has no hope. I will try drag racing it, because I think it might be slightly better at that. It, it, yeah. So, so all they've done is got a tractor, made it so that it can't do tractor things anymore, and turned it into a track, a track machine. But which is fine and everything, but it it doesn't like corners. Yeah, this is a disaster, right? Let's go and see if it can drag race. So here we are at the drag strip uh, with an anything goes race. So we're going to be against Audi TTs and Ford Focuses and Lancia Row 37s. Um, this is still rear wheel drive, so it might struggle launching compared to the Audis and Fords. Uh, in which case, we're going to find out that it's rubbish at everything. Wait, hang on, is the... Was that the engine at the back? Why are the exhausts at the front, then? Ah, oh, I'm confused. Looks like an engine at the back. Oh no! I found what it can do! We've won something, which is more than can be said for the for the Mercedes last video. So yeah, although the, the all-wheel drive cars get the launch, the acceleration of this thing just smashes them. So there you go, that's something you can actually do with the, the tractor, because if, if you've driven it, you'll know it, it, it can't do corners. So yeah, drag racing 
is what you can do with that. Um, but yeah, that's going to do it for today's video. Uh, I hope you've enjoyed it, and I hope you enjoyed the Mercedes video earlier, um, despite it not being able to do anything really. Um, but yeah, I'll be back tomorrow to test out the 6x6 and the new Ranger Raptor. Um, so watch out for those, but for now, thank you very much for watching. Uh, I hope you've enjoyed it. And yeah, like I say, I'll be back to test out some more of the new vehicles tomorrow.